prior to contact, we lived um, amongst the Spokane River and we had three regions, Upper Spokane, Middle, and Lower Spokane. We would trade with the Coeur d'Alene's at the Great Falls, and then other interior tribes would also come down to these areas, and we would also travel upward and uh, southward as well. Our people, um, we've just adapted. So Spokane Tribal Enterprises consist of the Wellpinet Trading Post, Spokane Tribal Credit, four Spoko Fuel Stations, West Plain, Chawila, Wellpinet, Two Rivers. The Two Rivers Resort, which consists of the RV park and a marina, an Arby's that is located in our West Plains Spoko Fuel Station. Shimakan Creek Lab, which in the last year and a half we've expanded services at the lab from water testing and the drug testing to also include a pulse test. Then we have our administration office here that supports our entire enterprise operations with the accounting and the HR departments. And then we also have Sovereign Power, which our timber industry falls under that. Tribal Forestry does all the groundwork. They go out and uh, mark all the sales out in the woods. Uh, the enterprise department sells to the mills and then we have logging contractors that go in and log the timber. The Tribal Enterprises is a really important aspect of the tribe in general because we employ over a hundred people, we create jobs, we have businesses, contractors. We are also generating tax revenue that goes back to the tribe in fuel tax, cigarette tax, and stumpage tax. We're right here in Wellpinet, Washington. The purpose of the Spokane Tribal Credit is to provide uh, lending services for Spokane tribal members. We're able to help tribal members, you know, get um, their personal loans or other places where it might be too intimidating to go into Spokane to get a loan, or whether it's their credit score or other barriers, we're able to assist where um, we might not be able to get that help elsewhere. This location is the Wellpinet Trading Post. We're located in Wellpinet. For us, um, the whole reason we're here is to serve the community. We're the only full service grocery store um, outside of Spokane. Um, plus we have Western Union, check cashing, things that our community needs that maybe other communities don't need very much. You know, checks aren't popular anywhere, but we can still cash checks here. We also do have a full deli that's operational Monday through Friday, and we have a full grocery store with fresh cut meat, um, fresh produce, and just regular groceries and general merchandise. So we try to fit all the needs of the community. This is the West Plains location. We're right before Spokane and Airway Heights, so we have a lot of people who do come and stop through. We have very good customer service. They do like how friendly our staff is. They like that we have a different array of stuff in the store, like different products. They like that we're attached to an Arby's. We have a different array of customers. It's just, it's fun to talk to people where they come from and learn their story. On average, we serve about 300 customers a day, um, and that's even during our slow season. We have great employees. We've uh, held our employees for a very long time. So every summer we bring in new employees with the summer youth program that's also with the Spokane Tribe. So that is a very good thing to have the enterprise as a company. So we are at Spoko Fuel Chihuahua and it is located a mile and a half south of Chihuahua, Washington. We're always competitive in fuel pricing. Um, we are also uh, known for cleanliness and good customer service. Um, we have a lot of different things that other convenience stores don't offer. We have a full deli, we have a full liquor store. So our customer are the communities around the Chihuahua area. So this store since 2012 has done over 3 million gallons and it's gone up every year. We're Spoko Fuel Two Rivers and we're at Two Rivers, Washington. My customers are vacationers so they're typically always happy. Our seasonal customer base usually is Memorial Day to Labor Day. The locals are important to cater to because we are in the middle of nowhere and the closest place they could go to shop or get fuel is probably 16 to 25 miles away. I'm Crystal Pakotis. I'm the resort manager at Two Rivers Resort. I run the marina. It consists of 341 different places on the dock where you can park your boat. We have 94 different houseboats that are parked down there. Um, we also have three houseboats that we rent out ourselves for our customers. And the RV park consists of 101 different RV sites which have full hookups. What we have here is solitude. Everybody that comes here is here to 
rest and relax and you know go swimming and enjoy the water. Everybody in the bands and villages had a role and every role was critical and important and that's pretty much how I see our enterprises as well. So our employees, we are a village, we are a band and every employee from our CEO to our board members to our frontline cashiers, everyone is an important role, a critical role, and we would not be able to sustain our businesses and be successful with every one of those people in those positions. But we're all an important piece.